welcome back to Andrina's Creations. Today I'll be showing you how to download images from Google. I just recently got this question. Um, I, every time I do a tutorial, I do show how to save the images on your computer, but this video will just be for that purpose. First thing you will do is you will go to Google and then let's say um, we're doing a Rugrats theme. So we will look for Rugrats. PNG. When you search PNGs, that means your background is transparent. Right here, we'll say all images, videos, maps, etc. So you will click where it says images, and all the images should pop up. Now, if I click on the first one, it should have like a, a gray and white squares in the background. That means your image is transparent. Now, you cannot save your images while it's like this. You need to make sure you click on the image and then when your image is here, then you will right click, save picture as. And me personally, I have all my images saved into individual folders. So um, I already have a Rugrats folder. So I will go to my Rugrats folder and I'm going to click on my folder and then I will click on save. I already have that logo saved on here. So you click on save and it's already saved to your computer. So let's say I will go to Microsoft Word and I will go to insert picture. And then I will click on the Rugrats logo and click on insert. And then right here, I have my image and it's a transparent background. Now, if it has a if you can't find transparent background images and they have a white background, I made a tutorial also on how to remove your white backgrounds. Just check on the description bar to look for that tutorial. Um, let's go back on Google. Let's say you want a background. So you will look for background. So let's say paint splatter background. And if you put HD behind it, it's much better. So let's see paint splatter background. And I'm going to get on images and then all these will pop up. And like, again, you have to make sure you click on the image and then you will right click and save it to your computer. Um, yeah, I know all my tutorials basically are based on how to do party favors. So let's say you are doing some chip bags or something like that. So you will look for Doritos logo PNG. And then all these will pop up. Easter's coming up, so Easter Bunny PNG. You will click on the image and then you would right click and save to your computer. So basically you can find so many images in your computer can find images, backgrounds, all that on Google. All you have to do is right click and save. So flowers, PNG, enter. Like this. I also got a question about borders. So let's say frames and borders, PNG, enter. So you will click on the first one and then right here you have a border or anything. This one right here has a white background. So all you will have to do is remove the white background. Right here it says transparent gold frame borders or clip art because you can also look for clip art, PNG or clip art. So right here, see there's different borders and stuff like that that you can save to your computer. A whole bunch of different colors. Just make sure you look for the color, let's say pink or blue, whatever. So there's so much you can do. Um, border, PNG. So the possibilities are endless. Just look for exactly for what you're looking for. 
um, and it should pop up. Again, if you can't find them on Google, usually I can find everything I need on Google, but if you can't, you can also go to Etsy and look for the PNG or clip art. Um, please make sure that when you are ordering from Etsy that you read the description because a lot of them are SVGs or PNG or clip art. So make sure either is a PNG or a clip art. Again, PNG have a transparent background. Clip arts, some of them don't. So make sure you are reading the description on Etsy. But again, you can find a lot on Google. I hope this video helped. Um, again, thank you again for all my new subscribers. If you have any comments, please comment down below. If you like this video, please give me a big thumbs up. And feel free to subscribe so you can be notified when I upload my next video. Bye-bye.